What the heck am I doing in the middle of nowhere? Well, apparently in Georgia, one of the greatest roller coasters exists in Fun Spot Atlanta, which basically looks like a carnival. It literally looks like no one is here. Not a single soul. I haven't seen anybody else walk through. This is so wild. I don't even know if they're open. 2023 best new attraction, Airy Force One, won the 2023 Golden Ticket Award from Amusement Today. You can see the roller coaster just peeking up over there. This place looks abandoned. We're gonna walk in. It doesn't even look like the ticket booths are open. It, this is very surreal. I mean, nothing, nothing is running except for that roller coaster. Everything is closed. Carousel, nobody at the ticket booths. They have a dragon roller coaster, one of these octopus flat rides, slides that you'd see at a carnival. A wild mouse is over there. And this is all sitting just on grass. They have metal detectors here, but there's no one here to detect them. So you just go right in. Parking was free, normally five bucks. I've seen the coaster going, but that's it. I'm assuming maybe that's the only thing that's open. They just sell tickets to that today? I have no idea. What in the world? This is like an apocalypse. This is so strange. Everything just completely immobile. Rip curl. God, this reminds me of like every carnival. They've got a scrambler, old school scrambler. I've never been to a theme park that's like this, where I haven't seen a single person once since I've parked. Nobody at ticketing, nobody at security, nobody on a ride, nobody at concessions, nothing. Oh dang, I wanted to ride the hurricane. I guess I'll just uh, let myself on the ride. Seriously, what if you wanted to ride the hurricane? Just to like knock off an extra coaster or something? No, no shot, dude. You're stuck. Absolutely beat. Dude, I just noticed this zip line. Are you telling me guests can go on this thing and go over the water? No way. You have to climb that thing? That can't be a real thing for guests. I found Samson, the monster truck that looks like it's gonna punch me in the face. And then the Tilt-A-Whirl. Like, what did the Tilt-A-Whirl ever do to you, bud? <laughs> this is crazy. And then Screaming Eagle. We're gonna walk a little bit further up to where the go-karts are and where this giant tower is. I'm just curious. Oh my gosh, Screaming Eagles, where you, where you, uh, you change that front fin and it makes you sway left and right. And then you get a look at this thing and you go, why is this here? The most insane roller coaster ever that should not be here is here. This is a straight construction site. The, I guess they call Samson Monster Truck is the, uh, the go-karts, but then I don't know what they're building here and I have no idea if guests could actually go up on this thing. Certainly looks like it was a guest accessing tower. I'm not sure though. Well, it looks like they have a little tiny go-kart track too. Uh, you know what I used to love as a kid? Slick tracks where you could like drift around the corners. They were just a simple oval, but I loved slick tracks because the tires would just get all warmed up and you could slide like crazy. There's no one here. Not a single soul to be had. We're gonna attempt to walk into the diner with restrooms and bumper cars. This is like stepping into a time capsule. This is like a weird pizza parlor arcade meets some sort of preschool. What in the, what, what, is, what, what, what? Of all things, they have Wi-Fi, but I can't access it. So I like, I just have, I have nothing out here. Into the arcade. <laughs> You've got like, oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think I, I think I might have gained a few pounds. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, dude! Look how old this game is. International shootout. What the heck? They've got skee ball though. I'm telling you, the cafeteria is a straight up liminal space though. Arcade is popping though, and by popping I mean it's on. There's nobody here, but it's on. I, I can't believe it, we made it to Universal. This is a clever girl. <laughs> Ooh, this place is wild. Where it is over here. I just feel like I'm walking through just nothingness. Like nothing is here.
This is like the land that time forgot. This is crazy creepy in the best way possible. I like this place. What in the world? The time tunnel. I'm trying to buy a card to go through the time tunnel, but there's no one here. I don't know how I buy these things, but it's completely empty. So after being able to get $1 on a fun card, we're gonna go through the time tunnel twice. Okay, swipey swipey. <laughs> they let us loose inside. This is old school fun house, dude. Oh. <laughs> oh God, I'm gonna like fall over. Oh. That was it? The time, the time tunnel's a crock, man. But hey, 50 cents is 50 cents. <laughs> I could have just done that twice. They're playing the X-Files theme and I just feel like it's very apropos with the all this like lost mine and stuff. I wish they had a haunted house. That would be so dope. That's what I was kind of hoping the time tunnel would be. The bumper boats are uh, big, very popular today. Lots of people, big weight. Although, you know what's cool about the bumper boats? This is a non-traditional bumper, bumper boat arena. Like, look at, the, uh, look at the track you got here. You go around that little island. It's pretty cool. It's not a standard one. Air Force One's drop is no joke. This is like, again, more abandoned and creepy, dude. Look how creepy this thing is. You got literally... He's like little kitty Ferris wheel, little kitty carousel, and then just this dude chilling up here. What does this thing go to? Restrooms inside? Oh, we gotta, we gotta go inside the restrooms, right? I wonder if it's open. This is so crazy, weird, and creepy. Oh, this is the backside of that? Okay. Oh, all right. Okay, now I know where I'm at. Interesting. I mean, this coaster looks bananas. Look at all the elements. I mean, again, why does this exist here? This is the reason why you come to Fun Spot. One of the managers did say that 10,000 people come here every single day on the weekends, but they're lucky if they have 30 to 40 on the weekdays. Air Force One. Look at how massive this thing is. This is unreal. Unreal. Immelman loop. You come to Fun Spot Atlanta just to ride Air e Force One. It is all about space. So it's like preparing for flight into space with rocket fuel and it's got a little bit of theming in here. Just got the green light that we can ride this with a GoPro on a wrist mount. Off sequence engaged.
<laughs> Holy God. That is so incredible. But yeah, you come to Fun Spot to ride this. Forget it, dude. This is amazing. <laughs> this is so good. Totally worth it. <laughs> Woo! All right. It's way more intense than the back. <laughs> How's there nobody on this? How, seriously, why would you not be here riding this right now? I'm gonna be honest, I think the ghost town that is fun spot during the week here in uh, Georgia is totally worth it for one thing and one thing only, and that's Airy Force One. That roller coaster is incredible. It is, it reminds me so much of Iron Gwazi, but again, it's amazing that it's here. Well, uh, if you don't want the fun to end, let's pick out another scary place to go visit and check out this video right here. Boop. Ah.